In a big order, the Ghaziabad administration has banned registration of three dog breeds, Rottweilers, Jogo Argentinos and the Pitbulls in the region. The decision is coming amidst instances of dog attacks that have been reported in Ghaziabad. The existing owners of these three breeds will have to register and sterilize their dogs within two months itself. That's the latest coming in. Shreya Chatterjee is now joining us live. Uh, Shreya, we, uh, we do know that there have been some instances of dog attacks on the back of which this particular order has come in as well. Uh, in number one, how dangerous are these three breeds and have these attacks been primarily been concerned with Rottweilers and Dogo Argentinos and Pudbills alone? You know, uh, Chetty, given the fact that they, uh, they are breeds uh, which are mostly one-man dog or uh, they're also often unfortunately bred for uh, dog fighting, there is uh, a certain amount of uh, uh, a sense of fear and a ferocious activity that is linked with the pit bulls or the doggo argentino or the rottweilers concern. And that's the reason we see uh, such an order that's being passed by the Ghazibad authorities also because there has been a rise of certain incidents. Now, for those who already have have these dogs, they will have to register mandatorily and sterilize their dog. But henceforward, no one in Ghazibad can either own a Rottweiler or a doggo Argentino or for that matter... A Gauri Malati, uh, she is an animal activist that is, who is joining us on the phone line on this uh, news that is coming in. Gauri, how do you respond? The Rottweilers, uh, Pitbulls and doggo Argentinos have been uh, banned by Ghazibad administration. Yes, they are known to be aggressive dogs. Uh, fiercely, uh, fiercely loyal and protective of their owners as well but in the light of the attacks this has happened so how do you read this so we are in support of regulation of breed dogs because uh, we have so many indian dogs anyway four crores more than four crores in, in the country which should be adopted instead of breed dogs specifically breed dogs that are that tend to be problematic if we keep a pit ball or a Rottweiler in an apartment and don't give it the exercise and the training that it requires, then there are consequences which are undesirable and they can be, uh, you know, avoided by uh, regulating the breeding and sale of these dogs. I believe that's what's being done. Existing dogs must be neutered and registered and breeding and sale must be stopped. It should also be stopped for Huskies and St. Bernards and all other pugs and varieties of dogs which are not suitable for Indian climate. We welcome this, but we want it to um, be enforced in the light of the dog breeding rules 2017 notified by the Central Government. So, in your opinion, uh, this particular order that has come in should be a slightly more elaborate and uh, uh, include a few more dogs which are not uh, easily adjusting to the Indian climate too? That's absolutely right. There are uh, so many Indian dogs which are absolutely... Uh, acclimatized to our climate, they are, they are much healthier, they are uh, loyal and beautiful. Why can't people uh, and the governments uh, be encouraged uh, to adopt these dogs? In, in fact, even the Honorable Prime Minister has been now uh, promulgating the, um, you know, uh, the ban on um, import of breed dogs, but specifically for this purpose, that we must... Uh, uh, you know, encourage Indian dogs and not have these... Hey, uh, Gauri, with a caveat, is that is that how I read the situation? Yeah, that's right. You are welcoming it. All right, thank you very much for joining us, Gauri, for the very latest details.